Mars Console Gamer Games and Hardware and Art Hi viewers and subscribers. There is a big 38GB update out for the casting of Frank Stone on consoles and PC. Here are the official patch notes for September 16th. Crashes and Blockers Fixed a crash in the Phantom of Cedar Steel. Fixed an issue where the user could not return to the main path after reloading a save during the Phantom of Cedar Steel. Compatibility and Compliance The Steam VR plugin has been disabled. Fixed an issue where accessibility settings were not applied when changing them on the start screen. Achievements Fixed cutting room floor related issues where the all-seeing achievement unlocks incorrectly in some instances. Fixed an issue where achievements related to collectibles became frozen at 50% completion in some instances. Fixed an issue where players were not gaining the Planganologist achievement after collecting all relics. Fixed an issue where the Entity Displease trophy was incorrectly unlocked. Relationships Fixed an issue tied to the relationship screen when playing through the cutting room floor. Fixed an issue where Sam's relationship bar is not affected following certain interactions. Audio Fixed an issue with an abrupt stop in music during the massacre at Jarrett Manor. Fixed an audio issue in the massacre at Jarrett Manor where a heartbeat SFX persists not as designed. Fixed an issue where jump scare audio is played at an incorrect moment in a curiosity on Main Street. Fixed an issue where the choice loop music was inaudible. Fixed an issue where the credits music continued throughout the massacre at Jarrett Manor. Fixed an issue with SFX for the Trapper doll. Fixed an issue with incorrectly triggered dialogue during closing the noose. Fixed an issue with distant audio being incorrectly played in a curiosity on Main Street. Fixed issues with missing SFX and Murder Mill and the massacre at Jarrett Manor. Fixed issues with missing dialogue in Murder Mill and the massacre at Jarrett Manor. Fixed issues with missing music during In the House of Darkness and a Curiosity on Main Street. Graphics and Performance Film grain settings are now always applied to fix an issue with possible graphical corruption. Fixed an issue where the DLSS anti-aliasing was sometimes missing. Fixed an issue with lighting exposure within the relationship screen in the massacre at Jarrett Manor. Reduced hitching with shaders in various scenes. Increased the target frame rate to 60 frames per second default if the dynamic resolution is turned to on. Dynamic resolution is now off by default. UX slash UI. Fixed an issue with keyboard incorrect inversions when selecting dialog options. Fixed an issue with chapter names in the cutting room floor whilst using a mouse. Object and environments. Fixed an issue with asset flickering during the Phantom of Cedar Steel. Fixed an issue with texture popping during Beyond the Gate. Fixed a collision issue causing players to fail collecting a trinket in the Phantom of Cedar Steel. Fixed collision issues in various chapters. Fixed issues with missing or incorrect doors in these walls have eyes, murder mill and in the house of madness. Fixed issues with floating objects in a perilous place, mystery matter and the massacre at Jarrett Manor. Characters. Fixed an issue where an incorrect character appears for brief appearances in the massacre at Jarrett Manor. Fixed an issue with incorrect character behavior in a curiosity on Main Street. Fixed an issue with floating hair on Maddie during the massacre at Jarrett Manor. Fixed an issue with a character disappearing during Beyond the Gate. Fixed an issue with Jamie incorrectly wearing a backpack in the Phantom of Cedar Steel. Fixed an issue with an incorrect animation looping in Murder Mill. Fixed an issue with Jamie when using the cutting room floor to restart Murder Mill. Fixed issues with missing or freezing animations during Murder Mill, Hunting Ground and Beyond the Gate. Fixed issues with character textures in the massacre at Jarrett Manor, Murder Mill and all paths must cross. Miscellaneous. Fixed an issue with a missing camera filter in some endings. Fixed an issue experienced with pausing during Twitch polls. That's it for now. Have fun playing the casting of Frank Stone. Thanks for watching this video. Stay tuned for more updates on games, gameplay of new and some older releases, console info, hardware and various art.